So hi everyone, my new book Lanchin in your pocket beginner's guide to building Gen AI applications using LLMs is out now on Amazon. The book is already a bestseller. As you can see, it is trending on hash three on Amazon bestsellers. So go get, grab your copies and find the link in the description below. So hi everyone. Today we will be talking about how we can access multi-model LLMs in your local system using Olama. So basically multi-model LLMs are those which can give you output in terms of images, audio or can understand different data formats like you input an image, you get an output as a text, etc. So basically this we would be doing using Olama. So in my previous video on introduction to Olama, I have already discussed how you can set up Olama for accessing LLMs in your local system and I have demonstrated Llama 2 there as well. Now this time I will be demonstrating Lava model. So basically Olama helps you to enable LLMs into your local system. Apart from text LLMs, it does provide support for multi-model LLMs as well. So Olama has support for two multi-model LLMs that is Lava, double L A V A and Buck Lava, B A K, double L A V A. Now eventually in this particular tutorial, I will be showing you how to use uh, the Lava model as the inferencing is very slow hence i am not uh, demonstrating live but eventually i have already run that code this took me around 30 minutes to run and then i will be demonstrating that so first of all if you haven't downloaded the lava model you need to run olama run lava this will eventually pull the lava model which is about 4.1 gb uh, if you have already run this command then the download would the downloaded version would be used that is pre-existing so if you're running it for the first time, only then the download will happen. Once that happens, you can straight away go querying about your images. For example, the prompt that I'm giving here is what is in this picture question mark and then the location of the image. So if I show you the look, uh, image, this is the image that I'm feeding in Langchain in your pocket. This is the cover photo for my debut book. So here you can see that uh, the model is correctly able to identify what is written, what are the color being used. The image shows a graphic with text that read Langchain in your pocket. This suggests a promotion of an application service or product called Langchain, which is designed to be used on a mobile device as it fits in the pocket. So it is able to make out the meaning of the name as well. It is able to detect the color of the background, red background with white and gray text. So it's quite good. One thing that I've noticed is uh, I was not able to do this when I'm using the word image in the prompt. And when reading some Reddit thread, I came to know that we should be avoiding image while using the prompt. We should be using some synonym for that that is picture or what so that is i'm using this what is in this picture question mark then the location of the picture so this is how you can use a model the uh, the baklava model or the lava model with olama for generating multimodal results or for interacting with images thank you so much